Knights in medieval warfare, guardians of honor and steel. In the annals of history, the figure of the knight stands as a towering emblem of valor, chivalry, and martial prowess amidst the tumultuous era of medieval warfare. Clad in gleaming armor and mounted upon powerful destriers, knights were the elite warriors of their time, shaping the course of battles and embodying the ideals of honor and duty. This video delves into the world of knights and their crucial role in medieval warfare. The Rise of Knights, Origins and Training The concept of knighthood evolved during the early Middle Ages, emerging from the need for heavily armored cavalry to counter the mounted warriors of the invading Viking and Magyar hordes. Initially, knighthood was primarily a martial skill, but over time, it transformed into a complex social institution defined by codes of conduct and hierarchical structures. To become a knight was no trivial matter. It required years of rigorous training starting from a young age as a page, then as a squire, before finally being dubbed a knight in a formal ceremony known as dubbing. Training encompassed not only combat skills such as swordsmanship, lance handling, and horsemanship but also education in etiquette, heraldry, and the ideals of chivalry. The Armor and Weaponry of Knights Central to the identity of a knight was their armor, which evolved over centuries in response to developments in weaponry and tactics. Early knights wore chainmail, a mesh of interlocking iron rings, which provided flexibility and protection against slashing blows. As warfare advanced, plate armor became prevalent, consisting of articulated plates of metal that offered superior defense against the piercing strikes of swords and spears. Accompanying their armor, knights wielded a variety of weapons suited for different combat scenarios. The lance, a long spear used from horseback, was their primary weapon in cavalry charges, capable of devastating impact against infantry formations. Swords, both single-handed and two-handed, were employed in close combat, while maces and warhammers served as blunt force weapons effective against armored opponents. Tactics and Strategies, the Role of Knights in Battle Medieval warfare was shaped by the presence and tactics of knights on the battlefield. Knights formed the core of feudal armies, providing the shock force that could break enemy lines or protect their own. Their mobility and training allowed them to exploit weaknesses in enemy formations, often targeting infantry with devastating charges or engaging in duels with enemy champions. Strategically, knights played a crucial role in sieges, where their armored prowess and ability to withstand prolonged combat made them invaluable in assaults on fortified positions. Off the battlefield, knights also served as vassals to lords and kings, participating in tournaments and jousts as displays of skill and honor. Chivalry and Honor, the Ethical Code of Knights Central to the identity of knights was the Code of Chivalry, a moral and behavioral code that emphasized virtues such as courage, loyalty, and courtesy. Knights were expected to protect the weak, uphold justice, and show mercy to vanquished foes, a stark contrast to the brutality often associated with medieval warfare. While adherence to chivalric ideals varied among individuals, the concept provided a moral framework that distinguished knights from mere mercenaries or marauders. Legacy and Enduring Symbolism The era of knights and medieval warfare eventually gave way to evolving military technologies and social changes. However, the legacy of knights endures in popular culture, literature, and the collective imagination. The image of the knight in shining armor remains a potent symbol of courage and nobility, embodying ideals of heroism and sacrifice that transcend the boundaries of time. In conclusion, knights were not merely warriors but embodiments of a complex social and martial tradition that defined the medieval period. Their role in shaping medieval warfare, from the Battle of Hastings to the Crusades, left an indelible mark on history showcasing the enduring appeal of honor, duty, and the quest for glory in the annals of human conflict.